Hey, what's up, you guys? Um, I've there's been a huge, huge freaking problem, and basically, in Infinity Ward's little game they got coming out, and I'm just gonna start by saying I was not a big fan of Black Ops Three, and reason is is because it was so fucking slow. I mean, the campaign was just bit balking in between pieces. It basically, like, they didn't put so much effort into it as much as they put into the multiplayer. Multiplayer was good. Don't get me wrong. But I want a fucking campaign that I can play without all this bull crap. I would rather have a character that's been previously selected that you get to play as. Not customizing characters because, one, they don't look good whatsoever. I mean, it wasn't that good. And, I mean, the graphics on PS4 does not look a damn bit different from Black Ops 2 when it was on PlayStation 3. But, we're going to watch this, and let me just... I don't know if there's actually a way I can show you besides doing it like this. Two million views. No shit. 26 million. Over 26 million views. And it has two million dislikes. And yeah, I disliked it because I've already, I've already got a brilliant idea of this game is going to be completely fucked up. So... We're going to watch it. Okay. I don't understand. Oh, fucking. I am tired of Boost Mobile. I'm serious about to put a fucking end to fucking Boost Mobile's ass. I am tired of having no fucking service like that. That is fucking irritating. Fucking son of a bitch. I ain't paying fucking six dollars a month for no fucking service. Motherfuckers. Looks familiar, guys. Um, it kind of reminds me of Modern Warfare 2 when Infinity Ward was in its good days. Uh, I, it, is, it already looks fucking disappointing as hell. I think my dislike button was actually correct. Death count continues to rise and there's no end in sight. This is Top Cat Sub. Divert and deploy all available assets immediately. Holy shit. Let's get to the tower. Go, go, go. Okay, so I'm going to give it a little bit of credit for if this, the gameplay is actually accurate from what it looks. If you get to drive uh, fucking aircraft vehicles in this game, um, it's pretty cool. But I don't think it's going to get me to play it. 
I honestly do not think it will get me to play this game. Battlefield 1 looks so much better, and I'm actually going to do a video on that with the trailer. Just kind of giving my opinion to the game. And hold on, I gotta, I'll gotta. i be back in a second. Alright, I'm back. I had a little fucking problem. Alright. Come on, come on guys, are you serious right now? It seriously looks like they just bunged two fucking games that came out. First, they made it just like Black Ops 3, and now it fucking looks like they added Star Wars Battlefront into the mix. Now, the idea of space fighting is cool, but I never thought it would be good in a Call of Duty game. These people do not listen to their fucking fans when they say they want a old modern combat game, which was Call of Duty, very first one, all the way up to Modern Warfare 3. That was modern. Then Black Ops came out. That was modern. Black Ops 2 was a little bit more futuristic, but they still maintained a good audience. And in 3, lost me altogether. Advanced Warfare I liked. A little bit. I liked, Well, actually, I liked Advanced Warfare pretty good. But this game just seems like a huge fucking drop on every single Call of Duty fan. I'm the, I mean, that's my opinion. Because, I mean, I'm going to read the comments afterwards. And I'm pro I could probably already see it. There's people probably talking about how they want their modern shooter back. I mean, that's the way I feel. It's fucked up that they don't listen to their fans. So I guess this is another part <coughs> of the supposed plan of Infinity Ward to introduce a remastered version of Call of Duty for Modern Warfare. And I loved that game. It was really good. But uh, let's just finish watching. I want to see what the guys say. Whoa, are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Close to 80 fucking dollars? Well, you know what? With taxes, it's gonna probably be fucking 85, 89 dollars. Maybe even 90. You mean these people are that fucking broke? This is just a fucking disappointment. 
Wow. <clears throat> I don't even know what the fuck to say about this shit. Guys, okay. This is going to be the end for this video. Please, and it, give me your opinion of what, what do you think about it. I want to hear what you guys got to say. Just drop it in a comment box, please. And I'll be sure to reply to you as soon as I can. But uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.